Yes or no? Yes? <laughs> What's up? It's Wednesday, July 6th, LWL. <laughs> um, sorry for the noise, but it's like hot as a gorilla's balls out this piece, for real. I am sweating like crazy. Sweating like crazy, but I wanted to say what's up to you guys. It's still kind of morning. I'm getting ready. I'm leaving the office. It's about 11.30. I got some outreach to do because I have to catch up because I'm off next week i know i didn't said that a million times but the struggle is real and just like this hair y'all it's this hot that this hair look like this so i gotta do something to it if i twist it up it'll stay twisted and it won't be like snap crackle pop all over the place and i'm feeling like don king harriet tubman all rolled into one but that's okay i embrace it but i don't like it so i'm headed to do my thing i just want to say hey to y'all and did i say lwl I don't remember if I said that or not, but what's up, Saturnity? Hope you guys are having a great day whenever, day, night, evening, morning, afternoon, whatever, when you are watching this. Um, yeah. Again, we're experiencing a heat wave, y'all, so your girl will be chilling, hanging low. I'm about to call my dad right now to check on him because I told y'all that fool don't be putting on no air. You gonna put some on today. yeah it'd be in the house sweating to death literally and i'm not ready for that yet so lord let's make this work i actually remove his spirit of hard-headedness so that he hears me he listens to what i have to say and he does what i have to say all right y'all let me go i'm gonna call my dad real quick i'm gonna go get some work done and it's actually cooler in my car getting in and out doing visits than it is in my office which has no air and no fan. Thus, the hair. Deuces. It's a little rabbit. Okay. Can y'all see him? Oh. He was hopping towards me. I said, oh no, you don't, buddy. Let me see if I can get closer. Let me see if I put my horn in Oh, he jumped. Did y'all see it? He ain't too scared, fool. Oh well. I don't know if I showed y'all our hometown celebrity, Duck Dynasty, and this mother father. What he doing standing over here? He got it all the way this side. Don't come, Duck Dynasty. That's Duck Dynasty. <laughs> I hope it came through. Forgive me, Lord. Sometimes you gotta laugh and oh just bite crying. I can't even talk. That's Mary Kay, y'all. Hi, Mary Kay. Hi. <sighs> Hasn't been that long since I just talked to y'all. I pulled my hair back a little bit. I don't know what to do with this until I watch it tonight. Yeah. We're going to, I said we're going to sleep. We're going to get something to eat. And then back to the office. Don't wonder where. I wasn't gonna tell them where I was just no, gonna I show just up. Said, don't well, don't y'all wonder where? Ain't none of y'all business where. Y'all think y'all know me so well? Hmm. I got a trick for you today. Yes, I do. More like a treat. <laughs> see y'all. See ya. Say L W L. I don't think they heard you say it. I haven't edited that one yet. Say what? Hello. Oh, well, I don't know. I don't think I got to tell you guys. Shout out to, ooh, Peaceful Journey, I think. I am not, like, looking at my phone or YouTube or nothing. But I want to say it's Peaceful Journey for coming up with sore Saturnity. I kept saying for sorority, and I asked for suggestions. And Peaceful Journey, and I'm, forgive me if I ain't saying it right, said, how about Saturnity? Isn't that perfect? Mm -hmm. Thank you, boo. Mm-hmm. What are you, Sister No Sense? You know how they make up names? Eh, hey, there goes Sister No Sense. Uh, no sense at all. <laughs> all right, so I got to throw. I'm tired. I'm gonna make up another name for you. What you gonna make my name be? Bye bye, Birdie. Ah. <laughs> all right, y'all. Smooches. Are y'all serious? Look how cool Chick Fil A is. 
when they get their own hand sanitizer wipes. Yeah, I love you. Nancy, you love Chick fil A? Where you eating? I only said it 12 times. Yeah. Eating somewhere different, suckers. Maybe they Eating somewhere different, suckers. Wait. <laughs> the difference is we're on the opposite side of the room. Got him. Oh, no. I feel like I'm 12 months pregnant. Just coming out to the to the floor. This high as H E double hockey sticks. Thank you, Lord, for the heat. Now this lady at my job gonna ask me. She's a heathen. Come out. What is what is this? Somebody donated it. I'm like, how you not know? I'm just letting them see. No. See, they can see it. What a tambourine is, right? Like a round thing with some okay, so um, I told her what it was, and then she comes back. You want it for church? <laughs> I'm not gonna eat it. <laughs> I said, Okay, I'll take it. I don't know how to play no tambourine, I don't use them, but whatever. It's a nice one, so I bring it in here. And this fool <laughs> doing it to her own song on the radio. Well, her song on the CD I recorded. You, we want to demonstrate, dum dum, yeah. She, she all excited. This is, I'm telling you, this child needs all the help she can get. Let me go back to her old down south song. I'm gonna turn it down. Mute your computers or your cell phones, whatever. Them for fast songs. They do. <laughs> you been a mother for me. You been a father for me. You been my sister. Pointed at you. Brother, you. Um, <laughs> by your, I'm your brother. You the mother father. See you. Uh, right I'm just gonna cut it off because she's gonna continue to do that. See y'all. I that in my office. <laughs> 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 Y'all see, I thought she had arthritis. Huh? God. Y'all see how Y'all see how this sis like a tearing that tamarina. But when I asked the whole I told you my arms were getting muscles. <laughs> I'm serious. When I asked the whole the camera, she can't do it. My arms tired. I should have left that in the in the office. You mean you kidding stop? me? I would have really been hurting if thank you. Shut your mouth. Goodbye, y'all. She makes me sick. I couldn't help it. I couldn't stop. Shut up in your bones, huh? Yes. 
Mm-hmm. Just like fine. Oh, See y'all. Oh man. Oh, somebody gonna be in trouble. You about to be. <laughs> Suck them on. Dum dum put down the tambourine now. Look at that. She would for that. <sighs> no. No, come on now. Get that ice cream off your chin. We're leaving readers. She got just a cone, soft serve. It's like custard. I tried a different one. I, I get missed those. I don't know if y'all have readers, but this is readers. Bam on ya. Y'all should have it. Rita. What? Sweet Dolito Rita. Be cool, Eta Ritas. I say my own remix. <laughs> Dumb mix. Sweet Dolito Rita. Those aren't even words that she's saying, so she's <laughs> about some. She make her own remix. Like, that's not even a. Anyway, I got a. Sweet Lito? Rita. Lito? Yeah. That's, that's my name? Yeah. So, can I finish telling them what I have? <laughs> what you have? Why are you still sucking down that? I got a mist though. Mine is a mixture of um, frozen water ice and custard. Hold <laughs> it. about to have a nothing. Bit, a little bit. <laughs> a little bit of cream. But I mixed um, green apple and raspberry. I don't know if I'm like it. Never had raspberry. I love the green apple ones. Thanks so thick. Green apple and raspberry? Mm hmm. Mm. Girl, but I don't taste no raspberry. Mm -hmm. Mm. Not bad, but y'all know what I should have did? I should have just got raspberry with the vanilla cream because that's almost like having an orange cream, but the raspberry cream tickle. Mm. Mm. This is good. Mm. I'm going to take this and use this at the house in case there ain't no air on. I can't suck mine down. It's too tight. In case no air on. See y'all, uh, that's the only time you see Mary Kay quiet, but then she got to come up for air for a minute. <laughs> in case no air on. Mm -hmm. You really gonna be wondering what's wrong with me? You gonna kill him dead? Got Evan Needle. That's good. Y'all ever ate the ice cream cone and the whole ice cream slid off the cone? She got nervous. She got nervous. <laughs> she, uh, you got me on that doing this? Doing what? When I was doing, doing you that. You only did it for five hours. See y'all. Man, look at him. Hey y'all. So it's your girl. I'm tired. I'm getting ready to go to bed, y'all. I'm going to make sure that I make myself look like somebody tomorrow. My hair is done. <laughs> Um, I just twisted it up. I didn't actually do my mini twist yet. I'm going to do that when I get some more time tomorrow. Um, I am having dance practice tomorrow, though, so at some point I'll have some time to do it. Uh, but again, in light of the stuff that's going on today, and it's just been so trying, and I want the girls to do our, um, the dance we put together for... I want the girls to do the dance I put together for Black History a couple years ago. But it's just so profound and so right on time for now. It's from the movie Selma. It's John Legend and, and it is common. So we're going to go and practice that a little bit tomorrow and uh, make it happen for Sunday. Because I just feel like that's a worthy tribute. And it's just, yeah. Um, But with that being said, y'all, I'm just tired. I'm drained emotionally, physically a little. What is that over there? Yeah emotionally a little bit physically um my week off is going to be spent doing some well needed soul searching and getting some things together around here um i have some things i still want to do to the place since you know i mean i still have nothing on my walls those are just obviously not things that have been so big because i haven't done them yet and normally I would never be somewhere this long. Like literally y'all, it's going to be a year since I've been here. Um, and officially living alone, like without any traces of a man. You know, that's like the first time in a long time. But, you know, I love it. I love it. And I'm not going to say I love the end of way I feel independent. Because I've been feeling independent for a long time. So, I mean, I think I came out the womb feeling independent. But, um, oh, 
the other day we went to DSW, I forgot to show you all these little shoes I got. Because I think they're so cute. And I'm going to wear them with this um, maxi dress. Probably for church on Sunday. I just thought the color was really, really cute. And they were very cheap, y'all. Or should I say inexpensive. And I like that. And if y'all don't know, I'm team flats right now. Because, yeah. I need to be. I have so many shoes that I don't wear. I'm really not a shoe person. For real, for real. I'm more into pocketbooks and everything, and I still kind of slow down with that. But, um, I'm getting to be a shoe person, but I'm into comfortable shoes. And all that cute stuff, mm, mm If I need to put heels that's six inches on, that's going to be in the house. That's that's going to be right in this area, because I ain't even walking out in the, in the dining room in six inches. Where they do that at? Not her. Okay. A really cute... I love the color. And I was like, yay me. They look big as heck though, y'all. But I got a big foot. They're so cute. It's like a coral. They kind of coming off as being tangerine here. But it's coral. So they're cute. I can't wait to use put those on. And that's what the top look like. Oh, and that little picture over there, if you guys can see it, I'm thinking of putting that back on my wall. I don't know. That's some, a drawing that my niece did. My niece, Brianna, a few years ago. And the other things are just paintings that used to be in my bedroom that girl by I've been sitting here since this time last year, just about. But I'm about to get in the shower, y'all. Get ready to take it down. Peace and love to you all. Thank y'all. Thank y'all for always being positive, for hanging in with me, for commenting. Um, you know. It's definitely appreciated you just taking any time out of your day to watch me and my crazy self, my mother, um, you know, a snippet of my life. So, um, yeah. Excuse me, a snippet of my life. And, uh, yeah, it's doing good. I'm going to give you guys an update on the love life, because in case y'all were wondering. Um, it's good. Um, there's been some new developments. So, you know, I'm just um, going with the flow for now. I'm not jumping the gun or getting too overly excited. You know, it's like when you pray for things or you ask God for things, you definitely, the saying, be careful what you pray for, is definitely true. Because, like, I've asked for certain things and I've gotten it in abundance. And now I'm like, I'm smothered. Now I'm like, please go away. I'm, I guess, does that mean I'm never satisfied? I don't know. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. But I'm happy. I definitely am happy. Um, do I still have butterflies in this situation that I'm in now? I do. I don't think that they will ever go away. It's just a different type now. Like, I'm happy, but I'm cautious. So, you know, taking it day by day, step by step. Because, you know, when you know your worth, you know what you bring to the table, you don't accept anything less. And sometimes you really have to force a man to know that. You have to force them to understand that and to see that. And if they are, if they know your worth and they really love you, truly love you, they're going to, you know, step up to the plate. So, so, all right, guys, I'm not going to ramble tonight, I promise. Mm. Oh, yeah, I told y'all I washed my hair. That's what I did after I, I took, ooh, they playing some Jodeci out there. And now they plant some Jodeci. If y'all don't know about Jodeci, where y'all been? Jodeci, yo, was my group. Let me tell y'all, I was obsessed with Jodeci as a kid. Like, my entire room was wallpapered with Jodeci. That's when they used to have Right On and Word Up Magazine. But I'm 25. Smooches, y'all. L. Wait, I can't do it. <laughs> Smooches, y'all. L. W. L. Ooh, ooh, yeah. okay. Thank you so much for watching. Thumbs up. Please subscribe.